what's going on guys lobo pixel here back at it again with another video and today's video i'm going to be doing another obs tutorial on trigger fire the last video did very well you should go watch that if you want to learn how to set it up i do show how to set it up in that video once you're done setting it up you can come back to this video so we can start on the tutorial on how to add green screen effects on your channel points it could be very rewarding for the viewer a lot of people in my chat use it and they love it they have fun with it it's not like a crazy tutorial it's really simple i actually got a lot of help from the people in the trigger fire discord make sure to join their discord they helped me on how to do this so i'm making the video to show you guys how to do it as well okay so let's get on to the video let's just assume that you have everything set up you're good to go and you have trigger fire open and ready to go so you know how we have different tabs here of images sounds and videos you're gonna want to go to the video section I'm going to show you guys how I get my green screens and it's completely free. The links in the description below for the trigger fire discord, this thing called 5k player, which is what I use to get my green screen effects totally all free. So don't worry about that. So first you got to look for a green screen effect. I was thinking about this one because I, I talked about it on my stream. I said, Hey, that's a good idea. Let's add it, right? Copy and paste the URL. You're going to want to copy and paste it here, right? You paste it. Boom. Just let it load for a little bit. The cool thing about this program is that once you copy and paste it in here, you could just press the download button and it instantly goes into your documents or your files or whatever. It's actually going to be in your videos and then you're going to go to downloaded videos. I have a couple sounds and stuff here that I put in a folder. We found the video right here. It should be a green screen like this. It should be like an MP4 file like this, right? I'm going to show you guys exactly how to add it onto OBS and into your channel points. So let's go do that. Go into your channel point section and then add a custom reward, right? As the reward name, my eyes, right? And remember, this is the most important part. You want to make sure 100% that these three names are the same. You want the reward name the same, the channel point the same, and the ones in trigger fire as well. So we can just leave it like this. We have my eyes here. Now we could go back to trigger fire. We're going to add it. And remember, the command name here is going to be the same way you spelled it. I like to do it in all caps. Uh, that's just me. You can do my eyes as well here, right? You're going to save it here. And this is how you're going to leave it. Now you're going to select your video and we're going to look for the fishy, right? And then we're going to put check mark, right? And then now you're going to save it. going to come together, but it will still work. I don't know why they don't have the spaces in between. So now that you have that set up, now we're going to go into OBS so I can show you guys how to correctly do this part because this part is really important. So now that we're in OBS, remember that when you add trigger fire as your browser source, remember that when you go here and you add it, make sure to refresh the cache so it can refresh um, whatever you just added as a sound effect or a green screen effect. We're going to go into my channel points right here. We're going to look at this and now it's going to probably show up as my eyes, hopefully. My eyes! There we go. You see that? I just added <laughs> my eyes and it's freaking hilarious, right? One last little bitty detail that's very, very important, guys. When you first add the green screen effect, when you use a channel point and you play the video, let's just play it one more time, right? Okay, you see how, okay, so you see how it's kind of like transparent, right? There's no green. When you first add it, you're gonna see like the actual green screen video and you don't want that, right? This is what you have to do. You're gonna go into this browser source and the most important thing that you're gonna wanna do that's very important so it could be transparent for you guys is go to filters and then you're gonna wanna add a chroma key. Honestly, when you add the chroma key, this part's really easy. All you have to do is just add the chroma key and whatever settings there is on the right right here that you see, just leave it at that and it's perfect. You don't have to fix it up or anything. So do not forget to add the chroma key. That's a very important step you add that filter go ahead and refresh the cache again and try the sound effect again and you will see this freaking hilarious one right here make sure to refresh your cache because that's the most important part of this whole tutorial and there you guys have it there goes the full obs trigger fire tutorial on how to add green screen effects using your channel points and having it pop up on the screen for your lovely viewers to have fun with you and hang out with you and enjoy these moments together please thank the trigger fire discord so much because they're the ones that did this for us and they're doing it for free and they have an amazing support group in their discord so make sure to check them out into the links in the description below i would really appreciate it really hope that 
this video brought you some type of value i hope you learned something new and i can't wait to see what kind of green screen effects you guys are going to use i mean if you just go on youtube there's a bunch of things you can do there's just way too many things you can do you get so creative with it and it's just so much fun to add that entertainment to your viewers you know because they do appreciate that thank you so much for watching this video and i hope to catch you guys on the next one peace out bye